I'm saying, Dad, it's my ambition to play for Manchester United. I, I, you know, I need to score in the Strefford end. My dad said, OK, you, I, you, you will. You will one day. It, it, it will come. It took me till 1989 and I scored in the Strefford end. <laughs> No, the only downside to that was I was playing for Liverpool. Yeah. That happened. <laughs> but I remember it clearly, honestly. A ball headed out by Glenn Hussein, latched onto it quickly in midfield. And I decide I'll play this lovely little right for half volley that will sail into Bruce's hands. We were 2 0 we we up at the time. And then we can just cruise in. Right for volley. And I'm watching it. And I'm thinking, where the fuck's Bruce? <laughs> and I watched it sail over Bruce's head <laughs> into the back of the net. Go on, no, go on, go on. why the fuck did you let it in? Did you not? <laughs> did you have two one in the back? <laughs> I remember a story <laughs> where you, Ronnie Whelan, went to the uh, manager, Bob Paisley, and said uh, after playing very well against West Brom, we were playing Man United at home for the next game. And you had to go down to the boss's office to ask for two more tickets. <laughs> you were asking everybody in the dressing room, can I borrow your two tickets for... Because you wanted to, bo uh, wanted to bring your mother, your father, and your brother and your sister, because you you said to the boss, I, I was a Man United fan as a junior. <laughs> because of the last game, I, I had a very good game, so I want to bring an extra two people. And Bob Paisley says, well, you can have five because you're not fucking playing. <laughs> And because you said you'd like to score at the Stratford end, I thought I'd help you out. 